Hello everybody out there in YouTube land. Today I'm going to be showing you and using for the first time the KitchenAid fruit and veggie strainer. So I saw online another person on YouTube use this and they said that it saves a lot of time by making or for making tomato sauce. Normally when you make tomato sauce you have to boil and blanch the tomatoes to be able to to peel them and get the seeds out. With this you can put them down in there and it goes through and what happens is there's like a screw in there and it pushes it down through and what will happen will be the skin and seeds should come out here and then the sauce should pop out and end up in the jar, in theory. If you have Roma tomatoes or little tomatoes, you don't have to cut them up. You can just put them up in there and they'll go right in. If you have bigger tomatoes, you're going to have to cut them up into littler pieces so that you can fit them in. I saw on mine that you want to do it at about speed 3 or 4. And then you just use this. Push them down. There you can see the screw turning. Oop, there we go. There's some tomato coming out. And we'll see what happens. There's our tomato sauce coming. So, as you can see, out of here comes the skin and the seeds and all that. And down here comes the tomato sauce as it strains it. So it's pretty cool and saves a lot of time. And then with the extra stuff, you can take that and dry it out and filter it and you'll get all the seeds to plant some more tomatoes or you can throw it out in your compost bin and kind of stir it all up and then you get your tomato sauce here and you'll still have to boil it down to get out all the water but it makes things a lot easier so if you guys have any questions let me know in the comments below hit that like button and subscribe it helps us out I'll see you guys later.